Action just four days away. The excitement, the jitters, and the final journeys around Wisconsin are underway. Candidates are preparing for the big day. NBC 15's Cameron Kelly joining us in the studio. Cameron, the Wisconsin Election Commission has shared what voters should know just days now away from the election. Yes, Maria, the WEC says the data today shows that there has been more than 754,000 ballots requested and more than 642,000 ballots that have been returned, which includes in-person absentee ballots. Elections don't happen behind closed doors. Every aspect of the election process will be open to the public on Tuesday. With elections around the corner, the Wisconsin Election Commission says they are preparing for the big day. Chief election official Megan Wolf says voters should know results are preliminary until everything is counted and double checked. Official results may not even be available until the very next day. The election results reported on election night are never the final certified results. These results have not been reviewed by county boards of canvassers or certified by the WEC chairman. Meanwhile, candidates are doing tours around the state to talk about issues that matter to their respective parties. Well, what we need to do is we need to drastically reduce the deficit spending that sparked inflation. We also have to become more energy independent. Uh, folks are showing up because young people know that their future is on the line, whether it's climate change, whether it's, you know, I know it's down the line for them, but even retirement security. Gubernatorial candidates Tim Michaels and Tony Evers both showed their excitement for Tuesday's election, surrounded by their supporters. Well, I ask for your help. These last few days, all of us working together, yeah. we're very powerful. Together, we can win this race. We are going to win this race, folks. We are going to win this race. I can guarantee you that. The WEC says voters are able to observe everything that goes into getting the results. They also mentioned they will try to provide updates for voters throughout Election Day. Live in the studio, Cameron Kelly, NBC 15.